All right, let's go see if we can res rescue the boy. Let us leave this place. Happily. Ooh, I love this part. That's better. I can feel things getting more normal already. Wait. That tree. Well, isn't that interesting? <coughs> what is this? That's the noose splitter. The one Odin hanged himself with. As part of his endless mad quest for secrets of life and death and what have you. What are you doing? It's a charged object, significant to Odin. Perhaps I'll find a use for it. <laughs> Brother, what they said about the boy... Will not happen. Oh, I agree. It will not happen. We will not let it. Of course we bloody won't. The question is how? Wait. You wouldn't seriously consider killing Heimdall, would you? I like this I horse. Will do what I must. Oh. Come is on, that... let's keep the You're horse. You're wrong to dissuade him, Amir. You know Heimdall. I grant you that he's a spiteful, I like vicious horse. little shit. And so loyal, Odin entrusted him with Gallahorn. If we have the chance to eliminate him before Ragnarok, we shouldn't hesitate. Considering his powers of foresight alone, that is an if of mountainous size. Yeah, a horse that can walk on water. I guess now I've seen it up. I'm just curious how he's gonna avoid like making the decisions that he makes that's gonna get him killed. Because what their sisters are saying, like whatever, is he's very predictable. Everybody's predictable. Him, Freya, all the choices that have they made so far have been predictable, so I'm guessing they're gonna try making a different choice. Even supposing we're all perfectly comfortable plotting an assassination, and I for one am a mite rusty at that measure. We've got no way to reach Heimdall, and no way to kill him if we did. I have killed gods greater than him. I don't doubt that, brother, but it's hardly my point. Who's this Heimdall character? Is he in Asgard? Whoa. What does this do? Kratos, I see something. <coughs> what do you see? I see you looking at the wall. Up there. Oh, okay. Ooh, I just see. Are you kidding me? That's not what I wanted to do. Alright. Look, I think we're missing the known's message here. We've all got our tendencies, and yours is to run headlong into danger to protect the ones you love. I do not intend to change. Not about that. Why should you? Apparently my tendency is to kill the one. Freya. I don't need you to comfort me. Either of you. Your accusation was cruel. None of us believe. The truth can be a cruel thing. Anyone care to argue with that? No. But Baldur's fate had many causes. Prophecy among them. How do you mean, brother? There are many tales in my homeland of those who fulfilled prophecy by attempting to avoid it. So it was when Freya tried to protect Baldur. And so it was when I accused my son of going to Asgard. Then we agree. It'd be foolish to go after Heimdall. No. If Heimdall must die for Atreus to live, then Heimdall must die. How can you say that, knowing what you know? Because if Heimdall is a threat to my son, I must act. It is my... Your nature. Well played, Norms. So what is that? Is that plan? Are we just winging this? So we're gonna go kill this guy. Is that guy in Asgard? I don't know where that is at. Let us 
Let's find a gateway. Return home. Consider our plans. Listen, brother. Before you make any hasty decisions, why don't you blow off a little steam? I'm sure there was some loose end we meant to circle back to. Give your mind a little time to process everything. I suspect there's unfinished business here at the lake, though I'm certainly happy to spend time somewhere other than Midgard. It's your choice, brother. Okay, we should be good. Let's go. the person sees their intention my intent will be to kill him knowing that will be no advantage brother this is no one to underestimate any move you make he'll have seen it coming if you must face him we need something else an edge humor me very well we will ask the dwarves ah the inevitable asking of the dwarves <laughs> Time. Oh boy. Oh, dear, oh dear, what's to be done? What is it you want? It has come to my attention that Neethog has been slain, and as a result, her offspring have been let loose into the Nine Realms. What of it? Unfortunately, without a proper role model to supervise them, the little rascals are certain to fall to mischief. In time, said mischief could culminate in nothing less than their devouring of the Nine Realms entirely. In order to avoid such a grisly fate, I'd like you to bring the lean worms to me. I believe I can act as a satisfactory paternal figure in their upbringing. You'll find the specimens gnawing on tears throughout the realms. Use this device to safely store them, bring them back to me, and I promise I'll make it worth your while. You mean to say you'd raise them by yourself? Indeed. I have no small experience managing extreme personalities. Compared to wrestling with my emotions in the most literal of senses, I dare say raising a handful of leaned worms will be a walk in the park. Anyhow, was there something else you wish to talk about? Can I grab it? About Neethog. You should know. We had no choice. It was Odin's doing. Oh, I am very well aware indeed of the alleged All-Father's role in this tragedy. Sadly, there's no exception to him to clean up after himself. Not all gods show the interest that you do in writing past wrongs. Now please, take the capture device and see if you can find our missing lean worms. Well, I mustn't keep you further from your goings on. Alright, so we got another side quest on top of side quest. Okay, so I definitely gotta try to do those do as many as possible. Cause I got a shitload of side quests. Oh, did the Norns tell you how to get Atreus back? Do we have a plan? The Norns say Atreus will be killed by Heimdall. The plan is to kill Heimdall first. Oh, wow. Okay, Heimdall. Let's see. Never loses. Sees everything coming. Unpopular at parties. This won't be easy. Whatever his party. I will overwhelm him with my own. That's the idea. You gotta overpopulate his senses, see? And I got just the thing in mind to help you do it. Sindri, go get Dropnir. Dropnir? But we need him. Our supplies. Oh, we got plenty. And to spare. Even if we did, Dropnir's no weapon. Why would a... Oh. You mean we combine it with... That's right. And then when he... It'll go... Damn you, that's brilliant. <laughs> Very well. I suppose there's nothing to do, but... Go fetch drop near. Go do it. Drop near. I bloody knew these two had nicked it. 
And Odin blamed me for it disappearing. They stole Dropnir. We didn't steal nothing. We just ungifted what never should have been gifted in the first place. Our will has helped me kill Heimdall. Never you mind all that. It's a fucking surprise. We're artistes. But to even store Dropnir, you'd need... You were saying... Now you intend to kill Heimdall. Violence cannot prevent violence, Kratos. I truly thought you understood that. No matter what you thought I understood, my son is in danger. You will not allow harm to come to him. Let's get this shit out of here. Enough. Heimdall's a threat, not only to Atreus, but to everyone. He's Odin's left hand, and he carries the horn that begins Ragnarok. If we have the chance to eliminate him, we then should... And it's just as likely a trap, because the bastard knows your intentions. Kratos, I've never seen anyone so much as lay a finger on him. Not one. Well, I gathered what's fit for gathering. How long will it take? We'll have to go to Svartalfheim to get the rest of the materials. Not to mention, we'll have to visit the lady. Oh. Ooh. Ooh, that's a relief. <laughs> uh. Ow. Kratos, whenever you're ready. No idea what he's on about, brother. I wish you'd come with us, dear. I know you mean well with that. But Let to be honest, drop. I don't like who I became on our last adventure. I can't be around the violence that follows him. That follows you both. I'm sorry. Yeah, he's a bitch now, so we gotta go. We gotta go. See you out there. I wish that was ah, a trophy. Time to go see the lady. I'll take it from here. Oh no! This whole thing were my idea. I'll speak to the lady. I never get to speak to the lady. There are reasons for that. Brock will go. What? No, no, no. I you have to. heard him. Quit your fret. I ain't gonna mess nothing up. Oh, he doesn't know that he's dead. What the? No, you pimp shrimps. Think that'll keep us out? Well, think the fuck again. What happened there? What was all that then? Oh, just Sentry trying to hog all the glory. Same old shit. Not that. The gate. What's wrong with a bloody gate? Most likely someone in neither of them have been making a fuckery of the works. Probably on account of all that incursion that you got up to. But don't worry, you little dangling head. Old Brock came prepared. I got ways in and out from the old days. Gates did never even think to look for. On account of being stupid. Oh, 
right? Brock, where are we? This here's your stop! Abandoned service tunnel, direct to the forge camp. I'll meet you up there. Go on. Brock. And he's gone. You sure he was the right pick for this, brother? I trust him. He speaks plain. And yet so colorfully. Whoa, whoa! Unusual service here. Elvish, I think. What is this here? I'm confused why that's even here. Careful, brother. That looks flammable. Flammable? Oh, wait a minute. Are we gonna be able to use that? Okay, I see. We might be able to use that on our way out. So, a tunnel for liquor and explosives. Little on the nose for dwarven culture. Ridiculing the culture you help undermine. Classic ace. Alright, I found that one. Well, <laughs> we keep cooperating, maybe someday it'll be Asgard in flames. That is not my goal. Doesn't mean it's not your destiny. What are you insinuating, Highness? Not a thing. <laughs> What's the door? Oh, this, we're in the door from him. Why would he hide in here? He feared something in these tunnels more than he feared starving. Hardly seems rational. Fear seldom is. Where's in this tunnel that he's feel? Oh boy, I feel like we're about to get into a boss fight. Oh, what is that? Abandoned service tunnel. So a lot of stuff here. I don't even know where to. Where did we come from? Did we come from here? Front or back? Okay, we'll go this way. <coughs> the hell? How do we get past this? Okay, who will take night? Oh, the floor, okay. Ah, a fortuitous oil spill. What's that for me? Why are we in this tunnel? Oh, that's injury? 
Bro, why am I so disarmed? Did I just come from here? Sandra, I... is that you? Yes. I need to talk to Kratos. I'm coming, bro. I'm coming, bro. I got this. I get distracted so easily. Okay, I gotta get in there. We went over here. Okay, I didn't go over here yet. <laughs> God, this place is so distracting. He can't talk to the lady. He mustn't. No. Do not ask again. But. Oh dear. <sighs> he's gonna tell me? Why he's not telling Critters the truth, man? He told the truth. You needn't keep staring. I'll go. Let's go. It's not his fault Atreus ran off, you know. Or are you just being Brock's champion? There it is again. You're insinuating and you know it. Can't the smartest man alive put it together? The giants conceal a mysterious figure who changes the fate of Ragnarok and you're oblivious to the only rational candidate. The one who's fought wars against gods and won. I am not their champion. Well, we're each entitled to our opinion. Hey, what is this about? Where there's a gear like that, there's usually a chain somewhere. So where's the look at the gears right here? These gates seem to be connected. See if you can break that far fixture. This dude, this uh, where's the magic? <laughs> There you go, there you go. In the back, woohoo, like a boss. I guess not. Can I do this way? It's open. Woohoo, solve them puzzle like a boss, let's go. sort of grim. These won't be easy tunnels for the dwarves to take back. That's right. Light work. Okay. We'll need to get one of those gates open. One of the gates. Where's the gear? Where do I have to move? Okay, apparently I gotta go this way, so... Yo, the water's coming here. Okay. And go. Okay, let's do this. That word, shall we? Is that what to the word over here? So I can go over here? Is, am I locked out for this? Uh, I think we are locked out. There's no way to get this water to come over here. I wonder why. It's interesting. This opinion of yours. Was that the reason you proposed this alliance? You expect me to lead your armies at Ragnarok? That is Tyr's job, not mine. It's plain to see Tyr's no war god anymore. Nor am I. I have left that life behind. Not killing gods you haven't. Or else what are we doing in this realm? Forging this weapon? Your choice. You know where it might be. I am only protecting I my... know. I know. And we both know the place is protecting the 
She's just trying to use me, bro. <laughs> but it's okay. I'm cool with it. For you, I'm over here to destroy shit. You know, I don't care. I'm missing one. I'm right there. Am I too far? Uh, prayer? There we go. Perfect. Please, something good. Please, something good. Yeah, some health. Finally. Two out of three. I didn't mean she was tall as a house. I, I know not all giants are giants. Not that there's anything wrong with the disparity in size. Or number <coughs> of limbs, say. Nothing in the world. <laughs> what is going on? Yes, she was a giant. Yes. Curtis like what he likes. Let's go up here. These damn turners. We can open the other gate. Perfect. I wonder, what the hell? Why is it you ask? I was just thinking of how Odin antagonized the giants for generations. Nearly wiped them out of existence twice. Now you may have a role to play in stopping him once and for all. Don't you think it's possible that's what your wife would have wanted? Do not presume to know what she wanted. I'm not saying anything about the car. Her secrets haunt every step of your path, wasn't it? Maybe if you talk about your doubts, they wouldn't explode when you talk to your son. I do not doubt. She knows what I left behind. She would never have asked that of me. Why would she need to ask? She saw your fate. Three of Odin's kin dead because of the path she put you on. You don't think she knew exactly what it meant, sending you to Jotunheim? This is mere conjecture and probably quite enough of it, Highness. We're all making an effort to cooperate here, after all. You're right. It's not for me to say. All right. Let's get that wheel coming. Okay. Then I could do one right here. There ah, go. Team well, that doesn't look good. Get back. 
Fresh air after that. Everyone thought so. It is close. I can feel it. Let me grab this real quick. Oh wait, <clears throat> this is where we came from. Man, these tunnels are crazy, man. Okay. Okay. Before we do that, I'm gonna take on this challenge. I got all the places to hide. Okay, I don't know what this thing is, but this did try. Oh, that was it? I thought I was gonna have a challenge. I guess not. Hold on, let me um there's something I want to do, the skills. I wasn't trying to provoke you or cast doubt on your marriage. It just seems to me your thoughts haven't caught up to your instincts yet. And I know something about that. I still less, Rhea. When we get out of here, I'll give you some space. Let you think carefully about whether you're ready for what it means to make this weapon and to use it. It's in my face, I don't want to think, think logically. Right now, Curtis is angry. Meanwhile, I'll see what else I can learn while we're here. Maybe I'll send a few Ain Hair Yar back to Valhalla for good measure. Well, you have fun now. Hey, you made it. About time. I got everything all set here. Now we just gotta push on up to the floor. Folky! Where's she going? Long as you know that ain't the way to the boards. Where's she going? Oh, she said she wouldn't give me space. She wasn't lying, bro. She just dipped out on us. Okay. Can I do this now? I don't want to get ahead of ourselves, but could we just come back to this one? Trust me. Where are you taking me, bro? Sure to go to pains coming here, busting old tear loose. What a prize he turned out to be, huh? It's time to steal my kitchen, though. Oh, finally! I don't know how to get over here now. <laughs> <laughs> it's 
go. Yeah. Where are you taking me, man? Jim. Forge ahead. Unintended, I imagine. Hang on. Almost got it. Well, come on in, stranger. Never do get used to that trick. <laughs> Locals up ahead. Act civilized, and hopefully nobody springs an alarm. No, what's your nattering, you snake sucking mommy milk sauce with your protective gear? Ain't you never seen a legend in the flesh before? They're looking at him because I think they know he's dead. Oh, that ain't no you see what's wrong here, don't you? It's Those over. creepy flying eyeballs made a nest up on the cables. We got to figure a way up there and clear them all. That ain't coming back down till we deal with that nest up there. Come on, let's try to get close. How do we get up there? That's so bad. Oh, no, I didn't need to do that. Ah. I was messed that up. I meant to do this. <laughs> okay, it looks like that wheel up there opened the gate. That wheel? Okay. Did this help me go up? Mm. No grappling up that way. Why don't you look around and see if there's a way to lift this lift? <laughs> Hmm. Let me see. Is it over here? Brother, did you notice the dwarves of the camp were twice as alarmed to see Brock than they were to see you? They did seem surprised. All right. Now I can turn this crank and cap that geyser there. You just give me the signal when you're ready. I don't know why Cindy Wood just won't tell the truth, man. This is gonna make things even more harder when he finds out. Now. On it! He is dead! We gotta have a post stop here. Just so many different directions. Hey, I got the crank covered. You do the other stuff. All right, clear. It's good, good. Ah, promising. Huh. 
Aren't we supposed to be doing it? Turn it. Copy that. Finally, holy cow. It took a minute. We got a heavy. We got a heavy. Man. I was just talking about that not too long ago. Oh, yeah, I maxed this boy out. So I gotta max this boy out too. Okay, this one. I think they've seen us. To the ford. Come on, the lady's waiting. Hey, got another riddle for you. Go ahead. What gets bigger the more you take away from it? Well, let's see. Something abstract. Okay. Appetite? No, that doesn't work. <laughs> stump the stump. <laughs> oh, isn't that clever? But I'm fun. <laughs> Stupid. Oh no, is it? Where is it? It's right here, right? Yeah, it's right here. Come on, bro. Ooh, that's brisk. Think I'll grab some for the lady. Grab some what? The wind? No, you idiot. The sound of the wind. No. Watch and learn. See? Dwarven magic's all about the intangibles. The relationship between the stuff what you can touch and what you can't. It's about understanding. Understanding what? What the hell? The nature of a thing's more important. Form of the thing. Hmm. Interesting. Hang on. I smell trouble. Show me what you got. <laughs> <laughs> Over here! <laughs> <laughs> to the ground. So this Whole realm. Boy, 
I've been waiting for my chance to meet her since I was knee-high to a Noken. But Sindri had never had it, said a too uncouth. But today's finally the day. Woo! I got goosebumps on my bunions. <laughs> Ooh, this is gorgeous. My bro, I've never seen you so... reverent. Are you nervous? What? Shut up! Uh. No! <laughs> oh dear. Let's see if I can make this on the first try. Oh, okay. I thought I had our shit, but there's no need. There we go. God, this place looks gorgeous. What the hell, bro? Every time I think this game can surprise me, he always finds a way to. Look at the detail on this freaking. Ooh. I think I can break that yet. I like what I see. I like what I see. This place is gorgeous. Let's go. Go on, pasty. Turn the crank. Let's do this. It does not work. Huh? What is it this time? Oh boy. Out of the way. Let me look. Oh fuck no. Do I gotta fix everything in this dang city my own self? I'm gonna need a couple of things. Follow oh, me. Boy. Yeesh, this place ain't in some disrepair. It's disrespectful, I tell you. I need that axe of ours to go kiss that material out yonder. The spiky silvery stuff. You'll figure it out. This lady, what does she do? Well, we'll both see soon enough, won't we? I know this, though. If we're real lucky, she'll give us her blessings. Doesn't give them to every piece, but the ones she does, there's something to behold. The axe? Well, that particular process was a whole nother cluster. Huh? Maybe sometime I'll fin you that tale. Huh. Interesting. What about this? Do I need something from here too? No. Bay's the only one who ever got my highbrow sense of humor. Damn fine woman she was. Apart from the taste in men, of course. Now I need a chunk of that bronze material over by all that busted up wood. Okay. Back in those days, I get so caught up in trying to be the best that I work till I boom drop. Fine, there's less to prove. You learn to keep your own safety. Save your extra effort for when it's personal. Like for when you finally get to show the lady who you are. Wow, you go. Goaty, you sure did give up on that riddle in a hurry. I give up nothing. It gets bigger the more you take away, is it? That's right. Hmm, sorted. It's desire. Nope. What do you mean, nope? <coughs> desire only grows when you take away the thing you desire. All right, it's not perfect, but let's hear your answer. Oh, you won't get it out of me that easy. <laughs> you done? All, All right. right, let's get back to business. One more crank to turn and it's onto the forge. I see no forge. You don't see the form of a forge, but we're going to the nature of one. I was almost following him for a the moment there. <laughs> I don't know what this is, but this is gorgeous. We're good. Crank it. Let's do it. Oh, 
She needs the final ingredient. The blood of a god. Give her oh. your hand. All right. You're almost forgot. Ma'am, it would be an honor if you might bless it for us. Are you, uh... Hello? Hello? <laughs> the fuck was that? She acts like I weren't even here. Mermaids don't speak to our corporeal bodies. They speak to a part of our soul. A part specifically you might be missing. Fuck. Fuck! Damn it, Sindri, you lion's cat scrubber! I knew it. I died. I fucking died! The fuck do you want? It needs a blessing. Yeah, well, the one to give us the blessing just fucked off into the tomb. It needs the blessing of a great blacksmith. What? No, no, I can't bless shit. I don't have all my soul bits. It, the blessing wouldn't mean squat. It is the nature of a thing that matters, not its form. This weapon strike true. May it be wielded with wisdom. May it be put down when its job is done. Hehehe. 
you'd be fool. How do I ever now use it? you know it? I can't let you take our new gal home without giving her a twirl. How do I Look, use it? We got volunteers. How do I use it? That is the question, my guy. Oh, you hit down? Oh, whoa. That's the stuff. Ain't your first time with a spear, I reckon. It is the first weapon a Spartan learns. What the hell? Ain't it just like old times here? Didn't just forget more for boarding lane myself. Oh, you can throw it? Oh, I like that. Let's keep going.